Well, if you have children, then you know sometimes it's hard to plan a vacation, and it can be even harder if you want to try an, an upscale getaway. But some resorts are starting to really embrace the younger crowd. In fact, there are some right in our area that kids will absolutely love just as much as us adults will. Joining us more on these triple threats, as we call them, is Amy West, the travel and lifestyle expert. You had my attention from the very beginning uh, because having a child almost two years old, it's like we want to plan vacations, but gosh, it's so tough. But there are options right. out there. Yep, and sometimes it's nice just to know you're going to be close to home, as well as I think some people maybe think that resorts are really expensive, but if you take into account that you're not paying for the travel and you're just going right outside your back door, you're really actually saving money. So it's wonderful to find these places that accommodate for the entire family. The Ritz-Carlton, Amelia Island, tell me about that. Yeah, you know, I've covered the Ritz uh, in my date night destinations, which I talked about here, as well as I just had a weekend with them, and they have some really wonderful things. Um, first of all, for adults, you're going to see Salt, which is their AAA Five Diamond Awarded restaurant. Mm -hmm. It's amazing, so it's a must-see. Um, they have the most amazing tenderloin. They have this uh, great in-the-kitchen seat, so you really have to get there. They also have a club level, so think about you know, your cruise ship that kind of supplies all right. your needs. Well, at the Ritz, you can stay on their club level, and they have five food presentations a day as well as all your drink needs and personal concierge service to get you whatever you want. And then to top it off, they have pirate tuckins for the kiddos. That's great. And then a little closer to home, we've got about 45 mm -hmm. seconds left, but let's talk okay. about the uh, One Ocean Resort and Spa, Atlantic Beach, right around the corner. Totally in love with One Ocean. Um, my favorite place for couples massage. Every year, my husband and I, we've been going there for the past couple years for our anniversary. Amazing. You have Azurea, which is their award-winning restaurant. And then their kids club is great. In fact, speaking of Azurea, you can have their award-winning chef, Chef Ted Peters, he will teach your kids a cooking class, which oh, is really wow. fun for the kids. Yeah. Oh, cool. This is great stuff. Uh, and after the break, Amy, you're going to tell us more about the Hammock uh, Beach Resort. They've also got uh, a so-called triple threat for everyone in the family. That's right. We'll Resorts right that back. have it all. Yeah. And we're back with travel and lifestyle expert Amy West. We're talking about uh, vacation spots for both the adults and for kids. And there's one just 45 minutes south. That's right. Uh, that's great for both. Hammock Beach Resort, another place that has it all. They have their own private yacht. They have an amazing spa. They have several restaurants, and they have some great stuff for the kids as well. Yeah, so, you were telling me about the, uh, the Kids Club because you want to be able to get away, feel like your child is, is doing something fun and safe, but the, yeah. the Kids Club, you just check them in and basically go about your way? Yeah, exactly. Just like you would see maybe on a cruise ship, they have themes for the kids. They have people that are there that are highly trained in educating and entertaining them. And so there's lots to do, or even if you want to play with them. For instance, Hammock Beach has this amazing pool that is, it kind of rivals a theme park, water park. Mm -hmm. They've got a zip line, several slides, a lazy river. So, I mean, there's all sorts of family fun there. They also do movies on the lawn which is really exciting. And so, yeah, you check them in and go to the spa, get a couple's massage, or more like it, enjoy their two amazing golf courses. Yeah, you were talking about the golf courses. I mean, these are yeah. the oceanfront and, and pretty pristine. Yes, exactly. And, you know, even though they're highly acclaimed, I mean, they were developed by award-winning, you know, just amazing golfers, mm -hmm. um, they have something for every level. So I'm not a pro golfer, but they had their golf pro sit with me and kind of teach me a little bit about what it's like and work on my short game a little bit and it was just so wonderful to be right there on the ocean and they're one of the the last uh, built ocean courses right, right there so they have the ocean course and the conservatory and they're very well known for the golfing and after you play those courses or you go to these hotels they're also connected to to other hotels through the salamander you were telling yep. me yeah they are part of the salamander resort family and they have uh, locations also in orlando as well as tampa and a brand new one in virginia that i can't wait to go to um so hopefully in april i'll be visiting the one in orlando because we want to do a little piece on what it's like to do orlando but maybe not everything Disney involved, maybe to kind of get outside the box right. and kind of see what else is there as well as in Tampa. We're going to be doing another date night destination, so I'm hoping to visit their Innisbrook Resort there. All right. Thank you, Amy. Parents, there is hope. You can get more information on each of these resorts on Amy's blog. That's the amywest.com. And from there, you can find out about booking information if you're interested in staying in any of these uh, wonderful resorts.